Right, hi everybody, Paul again, here to uh, carry on with our little lessons on drumless drumming. I'm joined today by Cody the Cat, uh, whether she's going to stay there when I start making the noise I don't know, but hey ho, if she does, it's great, if she doesn't, well, okay, as long as she doesn't scratch me, I'll be fine. So, um, first things first, a little thing for the inhibitionist jar, today it says, I am embarrassed with a big smiley face. Now, don't you see that? There we are. Um, sometimes it does get a little bit embarrassing if you're sitting there tapping away, and especially if you're not perhaps in time. Um, you know, or it's going a bit wrong, or you're getting a bit frustrated, and somebody's watching you. It's quite embarrassing. I got embarrassed today. I had to go to the post office. Uh, I'm standing there in line, two metres apart from everybody waiting to go in, and somebody tapped me. On on the shoulder, and I, well, it was, it was, a, it was a, a bit close, and uh, turned around, and uh, some random person, don't know who they were, said, thank you very much, turned around and went, excuse me, are you the strongest drumming man? And I was just gobsmacked, and a little bit embarrassed. So, hey ho, it does happen to the best of us, but don't be embarrassed, it's all good fun. So, last session of this week, uh, as I said, when, uh, Friday, uh, Saturday and Sunday, there's no session. Um, I've got to work on some stuff ready then for next week. And hopefully we'll be in the man cave because BT tell me the um, uh, extra bit that I need is coming today. So that's great. So a quick recap on what we've done this week. So we've started from the real basics and you can join in with this. So we're going to start off with a very slow one, two, three, four in each hand. So we're going to do one, two, three, little bit quicker. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. We're then going to do the one-handed with the eight beats instead of four. So we're going to do one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. We're then going to do alternate beats on beat number two and beat number four with the left hand while we're still doing eight beats um, with the right hand. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, double tap, two, three, four, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, single and double. together. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. We're then going to do the doubles on either side. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Then we're going to do a little mixture and you can make the mixture up or you can watch this back and you can then fill in with the same way that I'm doing it. So we're going to start off, it's quite simple, one, two, three, four, 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 one, two, three, four. Happy day. So that's giving you a nice bit of stuff to practice on. Um, as we said, there's a few songs out there. There's EastEnders theme, Hotel California, um, Love is the Drug, loads and loads of things that you can listen to and you can play along to um, and just count in a nice steady one, two, three, four beat. Um, it might sound slightly different to the record. That's not a problem because obviously they're putting in a lot more beats and a lot more feels, um, as, we, as we call them. 
um, as they go along. So the most important thing, as I say, is to keep practicing, keep that rhythm in your head, one, two, three, four. You don't have to shout it out loud, because sometimes that can put you off, especially if you're then trying to change the beat at the same time. But um, the last thing that I really want to look at today is where we can actually maybe, instead of doing a steady beat on the right hand, we can actually alternate it slightly. So we can do one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. You can build that in with your right hand on the fourth beat. You can build, uh, so your left hand on the fourth beat. You can bring in the left hand on the second beat and the fourth beat. So we're going to do one, two, three, four. doing is it's mixing up the rhythm so rather than just making it solid we're doing one two three four one two three four it's still four it's still even pattern it's still simple it's still doable but you need to practice you really really do need to practice so I'm not going to take it any further today I'm going to leave it at that. There's a few extra bits there for you to practice. Obviously go over and over and over what we've done. Um, all the lessons so far are obviously on Facebook. They're also on the Paul Varker YouTube channel, uh, which you can look at and subscribe to, which is all great. I hope you have a fantastic weekend. I hope your legs are incredibly red by the end of it, uh, because that means you've been practicing really hard and doing a really good job. Um, get the kids involved. Get your mums and dads involved, get your grandparents involved, let them all know about it. The more that can happen, the better it will be. Um, and we can get, obviously, people walking around the streets, tapping in the supermarkets, wherever they might be, in the car, you can tap on your steering wheel. Obviously, please be safe and don't take your hands off the wheel and then suddenly crash. Uh, we don't want that. But, you know, you, anywhere you go, you can tap. That's all from me today. Have a great weekend, as I say. I will see you quarter past four on Monday and uh, we can move it then to the next level. See you soon. Bye.